T-Metric is an advanced time tracker that is aimed to keep your projects, money, and employees under control. For this purpose, it supports a broad set of features, and this video will explain the main principles of time tracking. To start the timer within the T-Metric app, I click the Start Timer button, a green play button in the top menu panel. A time entry is automatically created in the timesheet, and the timeline gets recorded. Also, T-Metric allows me to add a time entry manually. For this, I click the Add Time Entry button, describe my task, select Project, Tags, and specify its duration. The option for adding time for previous days is useful, since a few days ago I was at a business meeting outside of the office all day long, and now I have to add this time to T-Metric. The circle icon quickly brings me back to today's time page. Also, I can use a time entry to add either a time entry or a break. I select a time span on the timeline using the mouse pointer and click Add Break. When I need to edit or delete a time entry, I click a checkbox next to it on the timesheet and then choose an action in the menu that appeared. Now let's review the workspace settings related to time tracking. In some situations, to generate reports faster, manage the task lifecycle, and control the entire workflow process with ease, I can set the required fields for time entries. I specified project as a mandatory field, and now I cannot start the timer until I add the name of the project the time entry belongs to. Next, I can lock timesheets, which prevents me from adding, modifying, or deleting time entries and tasks once a certain period of time has passed since their creation. Finally, let's generate the reports to see my performance. With one click, I get a detailed overview of my time utilization at any time period. That's it for this video. Sign up with T-Metric for free to capture time and focus on actual work.